Hello and welcome to the first problem from the June 2016 Algebra Regents exam. In this question, we are trying to find an, ex an expression that is equivalent to x squared minus 6, or sorry, x to the power of 4 minus 16. And as you can see from the list of potential answers, we're basically trying to factor this expression. Now the trick in this question is to realize that this is an example of a difference of squares. And you can tell when you need to use the difference of squares method when you have two terms that are being sub subtracted, that's hence the word difference, where the two terms are both able, you're both able to square root both of them. Uh, one another quick example would be 4x squared minus, let's say, 25, because uh, we're subtracting the two terms, and we could square root both of them. The square root of 4 would be 2, the square root of x squared is x, and the square root of 25 is 5. Now in this example, we're dealing with x to the power 4 minus 16. Now when I'm factoring a difference of squares, I like to start by drawing my two sets of brackets. And how it's going to work is that the term that we put in the beginning of each set of brackets is the square root of the first term. And then, so that'll be in both of these cases. And then in the right-hand spot of both set of brackets, you would write the square root of the second term. Okay, so the square root of x to the power 4, that is x squared. And I, I know that's true because x squared times x squared would get you x to the power 4. So we're going to write x squared in the front of each set of brackets. And then the square root of our second term, in this case 16, goes in the last section of the brackets. So the square root of 16 is 4. And to finish off, we just need to write a plus between those two terms and a subtraction sign between those two. And if you had the time, you could work backwards and expand uh, this expression using the FOIL, FOIL method, and then you should go back to uh, the original expression. But in the end, the answer to this question is x squared plus 4 times x squared minus 4. So that's our answer right there. So I hope that was helpful, and thank you for visiting JD's Regions Preparation.